Welcome to Den of Tools. Howdy ho, guys and gals. It's Red, your friendly neighborhood tool bear, back again here in the old Den of Tools. And today we're laying down the law, or I should say laying down the paw, as we are going to be crowning a winner for the best warranty in the power tool business. Now, we're going to be covering value pro, pro, and DIY levels. You know, so there's going to be three different categories that we're going to be looking at. And we've actually, we got all this, there's a lot of data here. So we're going to skim through it pretty fast. But I have a comprehensive spreadsheet listed down below. Now, warranties like this are important because they're kind of like an insurance on your investment in your power tools. And you know what else is like an insurance on your investment? <laughs> Our sponsor day, I like to thank today's sponsor, that's Next Insurance. They help contractors and independent businessmen like you and me. They help us, you know, basically, you know, avoid risk, mitigate risk, and be prepared also for success. We're going to talk more about that here later. But let's jump into it with the first power tool. We're going to go alphabetically, no judgments here. So alphabetically speaking, we got Bosch. We're starting off in the pro category. And with Bosch, what they're going to do for us is they're going to give us a one-year warranty. Now, I know, hold on, hold on, I'll hear you screaming, it's three years, three years. It kind of is, and we're going to, there's a lot of, of caveats in this because a lot of these companies want you to, uh, to do registration. If you register the tools, you'll get a free bonus of some sort or whatnot. With Bosch, that one year bumps up to three years on the tool, two years on the battery, and one year tool replacement with registration. They do have an extended service plan you can pay for. They've got, you can check for service centers online in my area. Now we used Vegas, that's where I am right now, as kind of like the general area. because It's nice because we're kind of an island out here. Two million people in the, in the area and there's nothing else around it. So no other like small suburbs and stuff to kind of spoil the numbers and you know, merging slowly into another big city kind of thing. So this will give you an idea in, you know, about an area our size, what you should get. And right now we've got zero factory centers, two authorized centers, and you can get parts online. All right, moving on to the next one. And the next one you might not have heard of before, it's Chicago Pneumatic. Yes, the air tool company has electric tools. I actually showed them off in my tour of SEMA, uh, was it two years ago? My gosh, was it two years? Wow, two years ago. Don't worry, we're gonna be back at SEMA this year. Hopefully I get to see them again then. Anyway, really hard to find any information for them online. I actually had to reach out to a contact over there. And here's what I was told. Five years on the tool, three years on the battery, no extensions. Now, they are sold through dealers, so you may get some sort of deal through your dealer. There are zero factory centers. Now, it does on the website. It says there's three authorized centers, but I'm pretty sure that they're pneumatic tool only. I don't know if they'll do the battery stuff because when I talked to my contact, he said you got to talk to Delegard Tools in Texas. That's where you got to send everything for service. So I got a link and for all that down in the uh, in the video or below the video in the, the spreadsheet. Next up, we got black and yellow. Now I know my default picture here, <laughs> default DeWalt, has the XR on there, but we're talking about all the tools. Now remember with all these, we're talking about mostly the core power tools. This is your 18, 20, 24 volt, that kind of range. And then also like the smaller tools, the 12 and the 14 volts. We're not getting into the teeny tiny four amp, four volt kind of stuff or the bigger 40, 60, 80, 100 volt kind of thing. Just the core stuff because that's what you're gonna build your tool system around. So with DeWalt, they actually have a really good plan and really good online presence. Uh, three years on the tool, three years on the battery, no factory extensions or service per se, but you do get one year of free service with the tool. What that means, I don't know, the lube and rotate the tires every 3,000 miles, I'm not sure. But they do have probably the single best online parts store that I've seen so far, full schematics on tons of tools and all it just really low level kind of stuff that you can order. It's really good. The service centers, I've said before, don't have a great reputation. They can take a while to get back to you, but it's really hard to rate that on all these. So we don't have a rating for that in here. Next up, we've got Festool. Now Festool, this is interesting. So they've got a one, without registration, if you're a pro, you get one year on the tool and the battery. If you're a DIYer, uh, as I say, a private user, uh, you get two years on the tool and the battery. If you register, no matter what you are, you get three years. So <laughs> there's that. Uh, the uh, there, I didn't see an extended service plan, but you know they're often sold through dealers and stuff like that. So you might want to talk to them about that. Now, as far as service centers. 
Well, you're going to be out of luck on that one because uh, there are zero. They want you to send this stuff in. Now, again, like I said before, it does require factory registration within 30 days. I just want to include that in there. And that, that registration, the warranty on that includes theft. Yeah, theft. But back to the service, they're promising a 48-hour turnaround time. Now, uh, now you're asking, like, why don't they have a local center? What, what about parts? Can I get parts? No, you're, you're not getting any parts. I, I talked to them, and they said, and I quote, Nine, you filthy American hands should not touch our blessed tools. You shine hunt. Or something like that. I don't know. I might got lost in translation. Anyway. <laughs> going up next. Yeah, I'm having too fun with this. All right, too much fun. Flex, Flex 24, the new kid on the block. Flex is offering three years on the battery, three years on the tool, five years if you sign up within 30 days with registration. Now, you're getting this 30-day registration thing. It's kind of a theme. But also... For this year only, if you buy the tool in 2021 and register it within 30 days, you get lifetime. Lifetime, it's, okay, let me see, roll this back. Lifetime on the tool, the battery will get replaced up to three times. So if it, I don't know, you figure that one out. Now, they do have a good online registration and parts and that kind of stuff. Now, I know there was some, a little bit of a fiasco when they first launched. Honestly, that was on Lowe's. They had said that the launch wasn't going to happen until for three weeks, and then Lowe's just released the tools. <laughs> anyway, what are you going to do when the box store just does whatever they want? In fact, uh, I know another company right now that's dealing that over at Home Depot. <laughs> All right, so uh, let's see what we got next here. And we've got Hilti, the other big you know, European company there. Hilti has 20 years, 20 years. No, but there is a big asterisk on that one. It's 20 years for a uh, manufacturer's defect. It has basically two years bumper to bumper warranty, including wear and tear, which is nice because a lot of these things are like, if, if you just wear it out, then you're out of luck. But uh, no, with them, it, it, for two years, well, here's the deal. They really don't want to sell you tools. They want to rent you tools. They're all about fleet management, that kind of stuff. So they do have an extended service plan. I didn't see an extended warranty, but if you're leasing the tool, then you're kind of covered anyway. That's kind of the way they look at it. Uh, there is one factory uh, outlet here in uh, in Vegas. And in fact, I did a tour of it. You can go watch the video on that so you can see what I mean by this. All right, next up, we're again in the pro line still. We've got Mac Tools. I know it's Stanley Black & Decker, DeWalt in disguise, Mac Tools. Allegedly, they have better, uh, you know, composites for uh, grease and other stuff that they can withstand. But anyway, that's what we're here to talk about. We're here to talk about warranty. And the Mac warranty is exceptional, as in, like, exceptionally vague. They don't list specifically a, a warranty on these. The expected life of the product, and it says warranty code C0, C component. So in essence, the tool itself is not warrantied. The parts of the tool may be warrantied. So if your trigger breaks and they go, okay, well, what's the expected life of that trigger? Well, it should last, you know, under your use three years and it's been four, you're out of luck. If it's been a year and they're like, they look at it and they're like, oh, there's excessive wear and tear. You've obviously used this a bunch. You're out of luck. It's really going to come down to your dealer, how you deal with them kind of relationship and how many tools you've bought recently probably anyway i gotta say for being a high-end professional grade tool that warranty is vague all right moving on to the next one we've got big teal here makita and you know the bear loves himself some makita so let's talk about what they offer which is really kind of basic three years <laughs> tool three years battery no extension no extended service Locally, there is one factory center, two authorized centers. Now, as far as parts, you got to call, all right? You, there's no online thing. I should have pointed out also with Matco, you got to call your dealer. You're not going online and getting parts. And there's really nothing more to the Makita thing. There's no gotchas. There's no registration. You can register. They're always giving away free stuff like side-by-sides and forerunners and stuff like that. I mean, go, go, get, go get yourself some of that free stuff with registration there. But uh, as far as everything else, it's that's just it. It's simple and easy. It's what you kind of like about Makita. All right, Matco Tools, another one of the tool trucks. Let's talk about them. Two years on the tool, two years on the warranty. 
no factory extended extended uh, service or, or warranty on this. Now, as far as service centers, it's going to be talk to your dealer again. You know, if the truck comes around, then you got a service center. If he doesn't come around, you're going to be waiting on him. So uh, repairs are, <laughs> again, I love this, at their discretion is, is what it says. That I kid you not. So, uh, I, I, it's, you know, you find this though when you get up when you're looking at the like the really cheap stuff. They always throw these great warranties on it. When you get to the really expensive pro stuff, they know kibitz about this stuff. They're like, we're gonna sell you a great quality tool and we'll warranty it if we think it needs to get fixed. If you break it, that's on you because you're a professional and we should be having a professional relationship. You'll notice that not just in tools, but in everything in life, when you start buying the really high-end stuff, a lot of that accoutrement that they normally throw in goes out the window. All right, how about some Metabo here? Metabo's offering three years on the battery, three years on the tool, no extensions of any kind. They do have a, a way to search for service centers online. In my area, none. There, there was none there. In fact, I couldn't find any pretty much anywhere, but... They're, again, also offering 48-hour turnaround time for service. So when if you send it in, they're another one of these companies. You find this a lot with the Europeans. They don't want you with your filthy hands trying to fix their tools. They're like, no, send it to us. We will fix it and get it back to you. We'll do it right. <laughs> okay, next up, we got the uh, big red Milwaukee. All right, I got to tell you, Milwaukee has, in my in my regards, the best all-around warranty, okay? Five years on the warranty, three years, or I should say five years on the tool, three years on the battery. Now, the, the battery's a little different. Two years for most M12 and four-volt batteries and one on NICATs, so be careful with that. Now, the there's no factory extension or service. You can find service centers online. Now, in my area, there was one authorized, I'm sorry, one factory and two authorized service centers. I've been to the local factory one, and it's it's a nice shop. It is. I like it. And uh, you can get parts online as well. The one thing I am going to say that they have a, an officially unofficial rule of if you, if, if, if the date, if going by the serial number of the tool, if it's still within warranty, they're going to fix it. Most everyone else is going to do this. Do you have a receipt? Do you, was it purchased from an authorized reseller? If you bought it online and it wasn't from their, specifically an authorized reseller channel, it's going to get voided. Some of them might overlook it. They might. But that's, again, a might. Now, with Milwaukee, they reserve the right to do that, but the unofficial official policy is, for right now, they're not bothering with that. Also, for almost every single other tool, and this includes all the tool trucks as well, it's the original buyer only. With Milwaukee, that's the same thing. But yet again, right now, and for the last umpteen years, they've just kind of been like, eh, I'm not even going to ask. All right, so that's one of the reasons. Five years, very liberal policy on what they repair. They're good about getting turnaround time on the stuff. They do a good job on it. That's why they're my winner for the best professional warranty out there. Next up, we got Rigid, but Rigid Red, okay? This is not the same as the stuff you get at Home Depot that comes in orange. This is Rigid Red. It comes with a lifetime warranty, but there is an asterisk on that. Lifetime, such as it only covers defects, not wear and tear. Again, it's kind of like the Hilti thing, except they don't offer the two-year bumper-to-bumper. Basically, if it wears out, again, you're a pro buying a pro tool. If it wears out, it wears out. You should understand that. If it's something we did wrong from the factory, we'll fix it. And they, and again, this is, of course, for the original buyer only. This is non-transferable. As far as service centers in my area, there is one authorized, no factory. Yes, you can get parts online. You can register online, all that other good stuff. All right, next up, we've got Skillsaw. Okay, this is, again, a Shervon company. So you're going to see something very similar with some of the other ones. Skillsaw has three years, three years on the tool, three years on the battery, five years if with reg sorry if registered within 30 days. Basically, it's the same kind of song and dance kind of thing you saw with with the uh, with Flex. It's, you're going to see it again here coming up here soon. Uh, you can find service centers online. Again, there's not one in Nevada. Same list, same list, guys and gals. Parts you can order online, all that other good stuff. And last but not least, as far as the professional line, we got the big boy of the tool trucks, and that is Snappy. 
Snap-on offers a one and two year, one year on the 18 volt. Uh, I should, I'm sorry, let me take that back. Two years on the 18 volt, one year on the 14.4 volt. I can already hear you clacking away at that keyboard, but my dealer will fix blah, blah, blah. That's great. If you're best buds with your dealer because you spend thousands of tens of thousands of dollars, sure, he's going to throw in some freebies like fixing your tools, but they don't have to. That's what the contract says when you buy this. When you're buying that $700 tool, understand. if Also, here's the other deal. I know a lot of places where the dealer just doesn't come back. Basically, everyone in the shop has bought everything that they need. No one's buying anything else. You can now got to call him if you want service and hope he shows up sometime soon. That's kind of one of my issues. Now, you can also send it into for factory service, and we got links for all that kind of stuff. Parts, you have to call a phone number and talk to somebody to get parts ordered for your tools. Well, there you go. There's all the pro-grade tools and the warranties that go with them. We'll get to the prosumer, a.k.a. Value Pro, and the DIY level tools here in just a minute. But real quick, I want to talk about this because talking about these warranties is, is like, you know, in business where you plan for the worst. Is your business prepared? Not just for the worst, but are you prepared for success? I know it seems weird, but uh, this, is, this is a real thing. I mean, picture it. You just landed the contract that you've been waiting for. The one that's going to take your business to, to the next level. And just as you're getting ready to celebrate, you hear or you get a phone call and you hear these words. Great. If you could just add us as the additional insured on your business liability plan and fax that confirmation over to me, we can get that first payment right out to you. Hey? What is she talking about? Additionally insured? Business liability? Faxes? Really? Faxes? But of course, you, you recover quickly and you're like, um... Yeah, uh, of course, I'll uh, I'll get that right over to you. But inside, you've got that uh, that sinking feeling like the success that was right there that you've worked so hard for is about to slip right through your fingers. Trust me, I've been there myself. It was a nightmare trying to find out what kind of insurance I needed, what the heck an additional insured is, and better yet, trying to get a timely quote so I can get back to the client Quickly. Of course, that was a while ago. Nowadays, it's super easy. You can do it all online from your PC or right on your phone. You just head over to nextinsurance.com, answer a few questions, and faster than my wife can figure out how much I just spent at the hardware store, boom, you've got your quote. In fact, Next Insurance customers have a free instant certificate which enables customers to get access to their proof of insurance and add an additional insured anytime, all from the website right on your phone, no need to call in. That's no small benefit. Every time I had to do it for my clients back in the day, I had to call an 800 number, I had to sit on hold till I was hungry enough to eat an entire pack of campers, and then I had to pay them a $50 fee for the privilege of them adding an additional insured client to my policy. You know, the one I'm already paying for. It's a whole new ball game with Next Insurance. Check them out. I did. They're, they're a legit small business insurance solution. Don't wait until the last minute. Click on the link in the video description so you can be prepared for when opportunity knocks. All right, let's get back to the warranties. Now we're into the Value Pro, aka the prosumer grades. And first up is Craftsman. Now, of course, Craftsman being a Stanley Black & Decker product, it's going to be very similar to DeWalt here. You got three years on the battery, three years on the tool, no extensions of any kind. You can find a service center online. Uh, good luck though, because if you click on the service center, this happens. All right, so we go to the link down there. It takes you to the Craftsman page and we come over where parts and service. Come over here, it says locate your product number. Come down here, enter your model number. So we put our little model number in there. There we go, we hit submit. It says, great, you can go to visit our service net page to get service. This is the same thing for DeWalt, Craftsman, Black & Decker, Boss Ditch, Porter Cable, and Proto. We come down here and say, what location's great, give me a location. I say, I'm looking for, da -da, what brand? There's a drop down here, it says Black & Decker, Boss Ditch, Proto, Craftsman, DeWalt, Porter Cable. I click on Craftsman, and the zip code area grays out. I click search, it takes me back to the Craftsman page. Are you kidding me? <laughs> This is what you spent $900 million on buying this brand so you can put an infinite loop on your website? I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> let's move on to the next one before all my fur falls out. We got Grizzly. Again, no relation here. Grizzly OEM this line from a, a, a manufacturer 
and they just basically stuck their name on it. I'm not really happy. I like a lot of Grizzly products. These, these are not my favorite. Anyway, that said, one year warranty. That's it. One year on the tool, one year on the battery. No service or support of any kind. This says there's a, a thing on Grizzly where you can go look for parts. I doubt, seriously, they're going to have parts for these things. <laughs> and and Grizzly is, there's there's no service centers near you. Okay, there, there's just none. You got to send it back to Grizzly for support. And anyway, moving on. Hercules. <laughs> okay. Hercules, as we all know, Harbor Freight brand here, which means you're going to get a base 90 days. Yep, that's it. 90 days on the tool, 90 days on the battery. Of course, that's not really a warranty. That's their exchange. They have a free exchange for 90 days. So anything happens to it, catches on fire, burns to the ground, bring it in within 90 days. There you go. Bob's your uncle. All right. Now, they do offer a one and two year extended plan. Prices on that are going to be based on the tool. You're going to have to ask the cashier when you're there. Uh, as far as service centers, it, it's the store. You just go to the store and uh, you, they replace it for you if it's under warranty. Uh, so there's no authorized. It's only the, the factory, the, 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 the Harbor Freight itself. Uh, and as far as parts, Harbor Freight actually does have a parts department now. And uh, there is a, a link down below to it. And there's a parts list and they do include Hercules on there. So you can see if they've got the parts you need for the tool that you've got. Next up, we got Cobalt, which of course is the house brand over at Lowe's. Again, though, it's a Shervon product, but Lowe's owns the brand. You're looking at five years straight out of the box, no registration needed, three years on the battery, no extended uh, service plans available. Uh, as far as locations, you go to the store. Oh, I forgot to mention, uh, Harbor Freight's in my area. There's six of them. Lowe's in my area, there's 13. That's how many places you can take it for service, 13 of them. If you want parts, they give you a phone number and you can call and you can cross your fingers and hope you get some parts. I don't know if I'm going to hope for parts on these, but they do have that option. Next up, we got some more Shervon, Master Force. All right, this is at Menards. If you don't know what Menards is, that means that you live in the basically half the country that doesn't have them. Uh, they're they're all over like the central north. And you'd have to look up a map. If you know what Menards is, you know what it is. They're the third largest big box store in the U.S. They're a big company. Why they're not across the entire U.S., I don't know. I'm still scratching my head on that one. That said, uh, it made by uh, made by Chevron, but they have their own deal here. It's a three year on the tool. It doesn't list anything for the battery. Now I've reached out to, we got some viewers who work there. They're trying to find some information. If that gets updated, I will update the spreadsheet. It didn't say anything about any extended service plans, but my understanding is that they do sell them in store. Again, it's kind of hard for me because I don't have them nards near me. All right, and uh, as far as parts and stuff like that, uh, there was a link there. So I'll put a link down there. Product exchange, so this is, again, you're not going to take this in for service. It's kind of like dealing with Hercules or any Harbor Freight stuff. You bring it in, put it on the counter, and they get you another one as long as it's under warranty. Hitachi, I mean, Matabo HPT. So I know they may be like, why is this one in, you know, Value Pro and not in Pro? Well, based on, on the price where they sell these things, it kind of, it, some of these are kind of a judgment call. And this one kind of slid down into the Value Pro section especially considering how much they've been discounted recently. So uh, this is a great power tool lineup. And this, I think, probably is going to win my vote for the best warranty in, in the, the Value Pro lineup. And I'll tell you why. Because the Metabo HPT comes with a lifetime warranty. Again, there is an asterisk. There are asterisks. Two years on the battery, though. No extended service plans. Uh, as far as service centers... Let me see here. We got uh, no factory and four authorized service centers in my area. There is a link for parts. So the lifetime warranty is the lifetime of the product line. This is different from everyone else. Basically, as long as they're building that tool, there is a warranty on it. Now, when they stop making that warrant with that tool, they stop making that warranty. All right. That's when your warranty ends. When they upgrade to version 2.0, you're done. So, but they, you know, the lifetime, or let's say runtime on a lot of these is like seven to 10 years, if not longer. So you got a good shot on that if you buy a tool when it just came out. If the tool's been out for a long time, you may be rolling the bones on this one. All right, next up, we got Porter Cable. Yeah, Porter Cable. 
All right, so Porter Cable, another Stanley Black and Decker. This is the <laughs> ugly redhead stepchild of Black and Decker, and they want, I don't know, they're trying to get rid of him. But anyway, three years on the tool, three years on the battery, no extended service plans. Uh, as far as service, it's the same service you're going to find mostly with DeWalt. You're going to find in our area, it's one factory, two authorized. You can order parts from that same parts store, so there is all that there, and it comes with one year of free service. Yeah, uh, good luck though. When the when the line goes away though, who knows what's going to happen there? Is it is it going away? I don't know, but that's a whole nother conversation. Rigid. Now we got Rigid Orange. This is the one made by TTI, sold through Home Depot. It's licensed from Emerson. They're the guys who own the Red Professional line. This is your Value Pro line, and uh, so anyway, Rigid is three years warranty. Now I know. Hold on, you're screaming. It's lifetime. It's lifetime. There is an asterisk. Okay. If you register your product within uh, 30 days, you can get a lifetime service agreement. It's not a warranty. There's a reason they call it an agreement, not a warranty. There are legal definitions and rights that most states have written into law that come with the word warranty. That's why they don't use that word. It's a bad word for business. So they have this whole thing and you gotta cross your T's and dot your I's and there's been a lot of people who've come to me and complained that Rigid did not stand behind this thing. Also, a lot of you are going to say, well, you can just take it into Home Depot for service. Eh, good luck with that. Now, some Home, De Home Depots will do that if they have a service center, okay? It's not all of them have it. And there's an issue with that. Some of them won't, won't accept it. It's up to the manager, okay? So as far as factory centers here, there's none. Authorized centers, there's one. Can you take it to Home Depot? Mm, sh maybe, you know, and then on top of that, there's been issues with people taking it to Home Depot, thinking they're going to get an LSA service on it and getting charged for it because they require you to give, I think, a hundred dollar credit deposit uh, for any kind of work prior to them actually taking a look at it. All right. And last of the Value Pro, we got skill. We're looking at the Power Core 20. This also co covers the Power Core 12. And uh, it's the same thing with most skill stuff. It's three years base, register it within 30 days and you get five years. Uh, so, and that of course covers, you know, everything else. It has the same online registration, the same online parts, all the same stuff of all the other skill stuff there. So let's move on now. That's all the, the, uh, the value pro AKA prosumer stuff. Now we're into the budget DIY kind of level. And first up, we got Bauer. Now, Bauer is one of those ones that, again, as I said, it's kind of like one of these borderline things. It's a judgment call. They're either at the bottom line of, of Value Pro or the top line of, of uh, you know, DIYers. So it all depends on where you set that mark. So anyway, 90 days, again, 90 days on the warranty for tool and battery. You can extend it to one or two years. Price is based on the tool. Again, it's not a warranty. It's a replacement plan. There are six of them in my area, and yes, there is an online parts store. Whether they actually have your part, I don't know. They're expanding it. They're growing it. They realize it's an issue, and they've been working on it over the past year. Next up, we've got Black & Decker. Yes, they are still a thing. I know. Go figure, right? So Black & Decker is a little bit different than the rest of the Stanley Black & Decker line. <laughs> Go figure. Two years on the tool, two years on the battery, no extended warranties, same uh, service parts, all that kind of stuff. You get uh, one factory local, two authorized centers local. That's about it. Heart, we're doing things with Heart. Again, another of the TTI line. This is over at Walmart. And with Heart, you're getting three years straight up. Three years on the tool, three years on the battery. Uh, there's uh, three service centers locally. You do not want to take these to Walmart for service. You can contact uh, Hart and find out if there's a service center near you. If it isn't listed or something like that, don't take it to Walmart. Just you, you won't be happy. Trust me. All right. Next up, we've got HyperTuff. It's odd that alphabetically speaking, both the Walmart brands are right next to each other, but they are HyperTuff. Two years, two years on each. And uh, as far as uh, warrant, you can get an extended warranty. A uh, Walmart does sell one. <laughs> so I, I don't really know much about it, but apparently it was listed on their thing. So you can do it. As far as finding service, there you, there's 18. You take it right into Walmart. There's 18 of them in the area. <laughs> Talk about, that's not including the local market grocery store versions. 
I don't think they have a service desk for this sort of thing. Just the regular super centers. There's 18 of them around me. As far as parts, your best bet is on eBay. <laughs> Next up, we got Rockwell. Yeah, they're, they're still a company, and they do have some cordless tools. Not a ton of them, but they have them. So we thought we'd include them. Two years on the tool, one year on the battery. If registered within 30 days, it jumps up to uh, three years. Uh, you got a call for uh, uh, service centers. I couldn't find any listed. Oh, and there's a big asterisk on that, uh, that three-year registration. It says online that to qualify for that, you have to register online within 30 days. And there's a link to the page to register. Guess what's not there? The page. The whole thing. It's gone. There is no registration page. There is simply no way to register for this thing. Uh, good luck with your extended warranty on that one. All right, moving on. Next up on the list, we got the uh, the yellowish green Ryobi. Ryobi. I, it's Ryobi. We all know what it is. They lie. It's not actually Ryobi. Anyway, three years on the tool, three years on the battery, no extended service. There are nine factory centers in our area. Why? Because you just take it to Home Depot. You go into the store and you drop it off and they take care of it. There's also two authorized centers in my area that says that they'll fix them. I, I don't know about that, but that's what's listed. Uh, the <laughs> uh, We have a link for parts. I'm not sure exactly how good the parts list is, but there is a link for parts. And again, remember, most but not all Home Depots are also service centers. So you got to call your Home Depot ahead of time to make sure that before you take it there, uh, of the nine that were listed, I did not call each one to see if it was a service center. So you got to call and talk to them about that. Next up, don't laugh, but yeah, it's Tack Life. Uh, I included this in here because a lot of people have been buying Tack Life, and I know they got yanked recently off of Amazon, but there's still a Tack Life Tools website out there. So you can go check that out. Tack Life offers two years on the tool, two years on the on the battery, no extended service plan. Uh, there is a link to get service. You have to send it back to them for that sort of thing. Uh, as far as parts, <laughs> that's adorable. Uh, no, there's no parts listed. They might be out of business. Not really sure. Anyway, I just wanted to include them in there because I know some of you all have them. Uh, we got Warrior, the 18 volt. This is the, the basement line over at the old Harbor Freights. So just like the Hercules and the Bauer, 90 days on the tool, 90 days on the battery. You can get an extension there for one to two years based on the price of the tool. Again, it's a replacement plan, not a warranty. And there are six Harbor Freights. You just take it to Harbor Freight. And there's six of them in our area. And last up, I know it's a big long list, is works. Because <laughs> they're doing it all because it works. Anyway, two years on the tool, one year's on the one year on the battery. If you register it within 30 days, it's three years. Sound familiar? Guess what? They're the same people that own Rockwell. Now the works page works great. <laughs> Unlike the Rockwell page, you can tell who gets the love in that family. Anyway, you got a call for uh, service, you got a call for parts. Uh, there's no local kind of stuff. You're not going to find any of that. All right. So if the bear missed anything, please let me know if there's a, I'm, you know what, there's a big long list. And I got to tell you what, my brain is mush after compiling all this data. Be sure to check out the spreadsheet. It's linked down below. It's got a ton of information. You can uh, post a comment or you can email me or hit me up via Instagram. Check us out on Instagram. And I will, if, if I got some information wrong, I will update it. Don't just tell me it's wrong, though. I need a link showing me that's wrong. Not that you heard from your buddy, sister's cousin's third dog removed, all right? I want actual, you know, factory-specific data on this. All right, anyway, big, big shout-out, big thank you to Next Insurance. I got to tell you, this is actually a product that I really believe in because, as I said, I've run into this situation in business where... We were poised for success and somebody asked me for this insurance and we're like, uh, sure. Uh, I mean, I covered as fast as I could and got it to him as fast as I could, but, oh, it, it was an embarrassing moment for me and I don't want it to happen for you. And I definitely don't want you to miss out on the opportunity that could take your business to the next level. So thanks again to them and for sponsoring us. Be sure to check them out just to, as a way to say thank you as well. Anyway, that's all the bear has for you today. There's your comprehensive list. Oh, I don't, I don't think I named a best, a winner of the best uh, basic uh, warranty, and I'm gonna have to say that it's, it's kind of a tie between uh, Hart and Ryobi. 
they have basically the same three years and three years. Uh, the Ryobi probably maybe a better service center and then you can take it to Home Depot, but then you got to deal with Home Depot. So it, it's a win lose kind of situation. Anyway, that's all the bear has for you today. You all take care. God bless. And as always, shine on.